All right, so today I'm gonna show you how to draw a chip on AutoCAD, save it, and then place it in Illustrator um, so that you can later use it uh, on the laser. So first thing you do is you open up AutoCAD, you make a new drawing, and you start designing your chip can do whatever. For this example, I think we'll just make a simple rectangle. Boom. All right, so then you go to save. You want to save it as a 2004 drawing file. That's super important. Otherwise, it will not work. So make sure you save it as 2004 drawing and then name it whatever. We'll name it rec for rectangle save it all right cool so now you want to open adobe illustrator it's going to take a little bit to initialize all right so now you're an illustrator you go to file new and then here it's going to ask you to change up the the width and height of your drawing sheet. That's not super important for now. We'll just hit OK. And then here we are. So then we have a blank sheet and we want to place our drawing file onto this sheet and then save it as a PDF. So I'll show you how to do that right now. You go to file place. And then you look for your drawing file, wherever it was, maybe downloads. Ooh, where is this thing? Okay, so here's your file, rectangle. You hit place, and now it's asking you to change up the scaling. So you wanna make sure it's on original size. You wanna make sure the scale is one to one, so scale one to units one, but you wanna make sure it's um, in whatever units you want. For this application, you wanna to stick to millimeters and then it's gonna change it, change the units to 25.4 cause there's 25.4 millimeters in an inch um, since it was inches before, but we wanna change this to one. So it's still one to one scaling, all right? So you hit okay and there you go. There's your rectangle um, and then you save it. So you hit file, save as. PDF, Adobe PDF file, and then we'll call it rec. All right, hit save. And then you wanna unselect all these options and then hit save as PDF. And then that's about it.